Game two of the series between New Zealand and India at the Westpac Stadium. And here they come, they are batting first again. Yeah, this one's a better. This will go for four. He is dynamic. Oh, down the ground. He hasn't timed this one brilliantly, but he'll get away with it. Will he get four? I think he will. Yes, he will. Oh, smash! Oh, and just over the top! He got a hand on it, but Saywate's going to pick up four more. Oh, he's got that away. Could be down a fine league, a chance there. No, he's got four more. He's on fire once more, Saywag. Smashed very straight. Oh, and he's got him, Vittori! He got it over Vittori's head. And over before that, but this time he's hit it straight down the New Zealand captain's throat and he snaffled it. And just say, Wag, 24 for 11. That's 29 for 1. And he's been pulled away. What a stroke that is. All the way for 6. Very important that Ian Butler continues that. First ball to be short. A nice first ball of a spell, a little bit cold. And he's going to go for 1. He's going to hold out 2. Couldn't quite get up, but Rainer, four balls for Nort. Yeah, 36 for two. That's pure. That's a lovely strike. We saw nothing from Yuvrash Singh the other night, really, but that's a taste. And again, down the ground. That'll be four more. Just gave himself a little bit of room. And O'Brien obliged in the right slot for him. Back onto the perimeter, as you see. That's uh, down the ground, and uh, it's not timed perfectly. Or I'm racing back. Well, he entertained the thought of getting it to Jacob Oren, but it just got away from him. The edge and McCullum takes the catch. Gumbia just a little edge straight through, and the Butler strikes for the second time. And twice in a row, Gambia has failed. Already three wickets down, and we're into the seventh over. It's 47 for three. Oh, this is in the air again now. Has he got enough on this? I think he has. Oh, it's been put down. Neil Broom. He had the opportunity to swallow it. I thought Uvraj had got enough to clear the fence. He's misjudged it. Oh. A little bit of luck there, and uh, it'll go all the way down for four. It was a bottom edge, I think, off McCullum's pads in the end. Oh, he's got that. He has got that in the middle. He's finally nailed Vittori. It's taken him a while. Well, he has to fetch that, but he's done it well. Back to back off for Tory, and another biggie. Flat and a long way. Oh, that's big. That's massive. Oh, my word. That sounded big. I've lost it. And it's 50 to Yuvraj uh, Singh. Monstrous. That side, you reckon? He's going to go. He's going to go. Yeah, safely taken in the deep. Beautifully judged, Jacob Oram. You've already seen great innings. Beautiful shots, 34 balls for 50. And India, 92 for four. Well, should take balls anyway. <laughs> He's got him. Only took one. Just sliding the ball through, the pace of which it's get it through. India, 94 for five. No, he hasn't hit that well at all. And uh, just, just into open spaces. Oram, he's a tall man, he was diving away to his left, trying to use all his height and length, couldn't quite get there. Too full, that's it, right in the middle of the bat and four. Yes, that's come right out of the screws. Oh, this is hit well. Or is it? Yes, it is! Smeared away through the offside. One, one bounce for four. Oh, straight, straight. There's a chance down there for the fieldsman. Gets it, takes it. Safe as houses. Martin Guptill. He goes for 19, 121 for six. Oh, he's bashed that away as he placed in the gap. No, no, he gets it though. He picks up four. Patan hits the straight, there's players coming round trying to stop it, has he got it? I'm thinking, no he hasn't! Oh, what an effort! There he 
that's applaud from McCullum. That was Gupto. He is so fast across the ground. Oh, this is a good way to finish the NET. He's got all of that. Six runs. Well, just what the doctor ordered as far as the Indians were concerned. Finishing on a high note. It would mean that the target for New Zealand would be 150. Okay, early on. And Ryder says, that'll do me. Now about six to begin with. Just short of the length at 132k. Well, this may be the reason why, is that uh, he's getting uh, some swing. 11 without loss. The boundary in the over to Ryder. And, uh, but I'll clap for this one as well. It's beautifully played. Just a little swivel. Wasn't that bad a ball. Oh, that's gone. That's a beauty. Way over the top of backward square leg. Use that swivel and hit with it. If you get it wrong, you've got no protection in those areas. directed though a full toss on leg stump and that's easy pickings for Jesse Ryder that's four and it's lucky nature of the game and that's got to hurt because that wasn't anywhere near the middle of the bat but he picks up another streaky four but good fortune for McCullough there he goes again that ain't good fortune that's good batting problems he did have a shoulder problem about a great fielding terrific fielding in the deep got him he has he's dragged it on I think Jesse Ryder and may have been held back and pace a wee bit from Zahir Khan well, he's out for 26 right he was striking it very nicely 53 for one Doesn't quite get hold of it, but uh, we'll still get the boundary. Oh, 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 oh. Maybe pick out wickets. To be. Yes, to be. He's given it. So lucky break for the Indians. 69 for two New Zealand. Oh, oh. Look like the top there, and that's been uh, dealt with finally. Oh, what an intelligent stroke that was. Oh, what a cracker. What a ripper. Yep. New Zealand playing very sensibly at the moment. Another half century for Brendan McCullum, and his good run continues. Started in Australia, half century in the first game here in Christchurch, and now another one. Oh, fantastic bowling. What a Yorker from least a four out of six and this one's dead right and India get a much needed wicket Taylor departs for 27 125 for three he's gone first ball arms nicked that no doubt about it it was wide he was right to go for it but he didn't get enough and hello Patan's on a hat trick and Hood's on their feet well this match has come to life that's for sure Short, wide, asking for treatment. A double blow here for uh, New Zealand. Oh, he had to hit it, and there would have been uh, a reasonably big shout. He played around the pad, but he got back. And that's not bad, is it? That's caressed behind point. That went to the boundary at the rate of knots. 16 from 9. Straight up in the air. Now, this should be caught. Patan, Irfan Patan, he's got it, he's got it. Hello, hello, India believe, all of a sudden they believe. Droom departs and New Zealand have lost another wicket. Still 16 to get from it, it's 134 for five. He's hit this like a tracer bullet for four. What a cricket shot. What a cricket shot skill in the end was very good from McCullum. They need 12 from six. Game on, 138 for five for these deliveries. McCullum, Ogilman on. Has he got that well enough? It'll skip through for four. Harbhajan can't pull it in. Game alive still. This is going right down to it. Where's it going to go?
Cullen Hunt straight, straight down the ground. It skids across the surface and out into the Oh, it's just fantastic batting. What a shot. The scores are tied. Last ball. Just enough timing. Oh, agony, agony for India. And Brendan McCullum. Well, what a great family moment, but it's been Brendan's night. He's got to be man of the match on both occasions. He's batted through on both occasions. His heart was in his mouth, and look at the fans. Absolutely. They're drained.